Chanting, marching, and staging a die in, hundreds of protesters held a powerful rally in downtown Orlando tonight. Similar demonstrations have swept across the country in recent weeks. Thousands are outraged over several cases in which white police officers have killed unarmed black men. In August, an officer shot 18 year old Michael Brown in Ferguson, Missouri. Brown's body was left in the street for four and a half hours. And in July, Eric Gardner said, I can't breathe 11 times when an officer had him in a chokehold in Staten Island, New York. That is why tonight, protesters in Orlando laid on the ground for 15 and a half minutes. West News Bob Keeling was there earlier as they dropped to the street. Here in front of the Amway Center, some two to three hundred people are staging this protest, this die in, where originally it was supposed to happen in front of the federal courthouse. Tell me what democracy looks like. This is what democracy looks like. At about five o'clock this evening, this group started with chants like I can't breathe, no justice, no peace in front of the FAMU uh, law school. I can't breathe. I can't breathe. Then they walked down Washington Street and down Orange Avenue in the middle of rush hour, then past tourists and others who were gathered at the restaurants and bars uh, along Church Street as well. Every step of the way, Orlando police have been monitoring this situation. They came out and said earlier that they fully support peaceful protests and said no one would be arrested as long as no laws were broken. To know that we have the support from OPD or the police department, especially when we're talking and saying things like, we want justice. And you guys are supposed to be like the liaison between the people and the justice system. You guys are supposed to be, you know, who we want to be protected by. And if you are protecting us, then Thank you. We all should come together. It shouldn't be something divided. We shouldn't be separated, especially when it comes to something so sensitive as this matter. Reporting in Orange County, Bob Keeling, West 2 News.